YouTube. This is David at Architects Outdoor TV. Join us this time. We got the honey hole again this morning. It's a beautiful morning, 30 degrees outside, sun is shining. A great day to hunt some rabbits. Let me see if I can get us. There we go. Great day to hunt some rabbits here in the Architects. We're at the honey hole this morning. So come on, join us as we go on another hunting adventure. I'll get back with you when we get a jump. David out. Hey guys, I want to show you something about my dog. I don't have, I don't carry my dogs to the woods on leashes. Number one, I got too many. And I'm always hunting by myself. So I train my dogs off the leash. And so my dogs have learned me just like I learned them. They know when I'm ready to hunt and when I'm not ready to hunt. As long as I continue to walk like I'm walking. They'll continue to walk like they're walking if they go in the woods. All I gotta do is go whoop, whoop, and they'll come right back out and continue to walk like I'm walking. Now once I stop, whoop, whoop. see there? They went in, I said whoop, come right on out. Cause they know I don't wanna hunt right here. You train your dogs to hunt how you want them to hunt. Whoop, come on Coco, come on this way. And she smells something. But if I tell her, whoop, come on, she'll come on out. All the rest of them will do the same thing. So that's just a friendly tip on training your dogs. You train your dogs the way you hunt. Everybody got a different style of hunting. And this is the way I train my dogs to hunt for me. I don't like my dogs to range wide or far. That way, when they jump a rabbit, traditionally, it's not far from where I am. Whoop! All right. I'll be back when we get a jump. Let me get to the honey hole. Ooh, Jenny and them just jumping. Her and Cousin. Stay on his edge. He starts moving out to the left. I don't know if he's gonna come out. First race of the morning, y'all.
you see no red? Well, you ain't see no red. But he came across there. That joker must have come across that fast. He going the same direction that other red went. Wow. I didn't even see that rabbit. Guys, if you see the chicken houses over there in the distance, there's a hill right before them. You'll see it. And what it is, is the dogs ran their rabbit across this opening, and he went into the pasture. This is private land, so I end up calling the dogs back off of this rabbit. God, dog it. That's what I didn't want to do. You gonna come back? That rabbit went way over there. Wow. Woo. What? Yep, got another jump. Coco. That's the thing about Sue, she a cold nosed dog. But she could pick up on that cold track better than them hot nosed dogs. She say, What is a cold nosed dog? A cold nosed dog is a dog that barks on a, a, a cold trail, meaning that the rabbit was there, but he's gone now. And he was he has been there for he's been gone for a while. Maybe he was there sometime this morning way before the dogs got there. And that trail, that scent has dissipated some. Whereas a hot nose dog, he's barking on the rabbit that just got up. Who's saying, what's up with you? So that's the difference between a hot nose dog and a cold nose dog. A hot nose dog gonna bark only on the rabbit that has just gotten up in front of him. And that's an actual hot rabbit scent. Cold nose dog might be barking on that rabbit. That rabbit might have been there an hour ago. They get him. He been through there. They ain't got that hot scent yet. They ain't got that warm scent yet. Let's see if they're going to work it out. Yep, they just worked it out. <laughs> she just jumped him. <laughs> she just jumped him. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I say it's hot now. <laughs> Ooh, that's funny when them dogs do that. I mean, they sound like somebody in the pour some scalding hot water on them.
Ooh, where are you going this time? He might circle around to the left here. Let's see if we can't get a shot on him. Over here in this opening here. Maybe we can't come and catch him, around, catch him coming around this opening. Which way are you going? I sure hope he don't go back towards that private land. Come on down to the left, buddy. Come on to the left, buddy. Nope, he went to the right. Never fails. They always do what you don't want them to do. Let's see. Ooh, listen at the music, baby. Jenny jumped that one. Well, let me say, Coco initially jumped him. But Jenny picked up on him and actually jumped him, jumped him. Let's see what he's going to do. He be quiet. Pointed on that joker. Yeah. Hey guys, this rabbit stopped behind a tree. And I was waiting for the rabbit to move out into the opening. But instead of him moving out into the opening, he turned and went the opposite direction and went down through that bottom where I couldn't get a clear hey, shot. Rabbit. Go going that way. God dog it. That joker went all around me, boy. It's big swamp rabbit. That sap sucker would not come up here. I should have shot him when I first saw him. He would not come up this way.
Joker was supposed to come up, right come up, right through here. He trying to throw him off. But he ain't throwing him off, boy. They went where he went. Coco them over there where he at. Let me pull him on him because I know which way he went. He tried to throw him off. He trying to throw him off. Yep, he trying to throw him off, but he went this way. He went this way. Whoop, 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 whoop. There you go, there you go, there you go. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Fire it. Coco on him. Coco on him. That sap sucker will not come up through here. That sap sucker wouldn't, he wouldn't come out to give me a shot. I'm gonna get him though. You're making a mistake, Sam Sucker. You will never come out of there. Give me a shot. I just went all around me. That's all right. You're going to make a mistake. You own him too, baby. Well guys, unfortunately this rabbit ended up getting away, but such is life in the rabbit woods. That's why they call it hunting and not killing. But at least I left some stock for next year's batch. So I left some, some rabbits in the woods for them to breed and multiply to refill the honey hole. So stay with us. All right, you two, we made it back to the truck. Didn't get anything today. Dogs ran good. They jumped four rabbits, but I could not cut them off. As you saw earlier, two of them went over on um, private land, so I had to call my dogs back in off of private land. And the other two, I just couldn't cut them off. So we back at the truck now, finna load up. Thank you for joining us. Please like and subscribe. Tell somebody about us.
David out.